In this video, I'm gonna show you where to find enough skill magazines to get the thirst for knowledge achievement. And you'll also get permanent skill upgrades for your character, like things like carry capacity, damage increase for certain types of weapons. Let's get into the first one. The first one's actually in the lodge on New Atlantis. So right over here at the lodge, right by the artifacts on this table, there's a page. You probably found this one, maybe you didn't, it's right there. Now we're gonna to go to the Mast District, which is on New Atlantis as well. So right over here, you can teleport to this area from the actual uh, planet itself. So once you get here and you see the big Mast building, we're actually gonna go into that building specifically. You'll see there is an elevator behind it. Now some of these things might require you to have done a little bit of the story. So if something's locked, it just means you need to progress the main story a little bit more or like a side quest in that area. So you're just gonna follow along here in this area on this coffee table, you're gonna find the next page. Go ahead and pick that one up. The next one is also gonna start from the Mast District in New Atlantis, and we're gonna go down this ramp over here. You'll see the trains in front of you. You're gonna take a lift and you'll see an elevator in the distance. We're gonna go into this elevator to go down to the well. So go ahead, activate that, take you down here. Now you're gonna run straight across up until that sign where it says exit. You're gonna go through the tunnel and you're gonna take the first right, right over here. You'll see Trade Authority in front of you and a store on your right. Go inside the store and you'll see immediately on the right hand side on a little table, you will find another magazine there. Cool. So we're going to start from the Moss District yet again. We're going to go back down to the well actually as well. So go back down there or if you're down from there, you'll just follow the same pathway that we took here up and through the tunnel, through the exit. But this time you're going to go left and you'll see Kay's house right over here. This is like a restaurant kind of thing. Enter here and you're going to go to the back left and you're going to immediately take a right. And then you're going to go up the stairs on the right and through this door right over here. This will open up the door into the room and immediately on the right, there'll be a table with the next magazine. The next one's gonna require us to go to the key. If you don't know where this is or what this is, you need to progress the main story until you can get this. This is a floating space station outside New Atlantis. You will have to dock once you're within 500 meters. And once you're in the key, you're gonna walk until you can take the right turn right over here. And you're gonna go into this first room and you'll see on this like blanket or something over here, there is a book you can read. For the next one, we're gonna be heading to Seoul, more specifically the moon of Earth, which actually has a space station flying around it. And that's actually where we're gonna be going. It's the Nova Galactic uh, Space Yard. Once you're within 500 meters, you'll be able to dock here. So go ahead and do that, dock this place. And you'll just follow along with me. There are enemies involved in this case here. Um, I did not kill all of them first. So just follow along with me here. As you enter, you're gonna basically take the right and you're gonna go through here. You're gonna immediately turn to the left. So just follow with me. Just go on along this pathway. I try to like ignore the enemies as much as I could, but I got tempted. Immediately go up the stairs on the left. And then you're gonna go up the stairs again on the left on this side, I missed that shot. Through this door over here. And then follow the pathway to the right. And then this will just lead you along like this. And then you're gonna open up this door and the magazine is gonna be in this room right in front of you, right in front of this chair. So go ahead and read that one there. Okay, back to the soul system. This time we are going to a new planet in here called Mars. We're going to Mars. If you have not been to Mars before, I don't think there's anything that stops you, but I think you can come here whenever you want. So go ahead and land on Sidonia, which is like the main, the main like station of Mars. So enter here and you're gonna basically head straight and just follow along with me. You'll see there's a days without incident sign. You're gonna go down this ramp. And at the bottom of this ramp, you're going to turn left. And you'll see there is a yellow door that says stairs. And we're gonna take this and we're gonna go down the stairs until it opens up to a main room in front of us. And we're gonna go left. So left through that door over there. So just follow along with me here. As we go left, we're going to turn left again past the fence. And you'll find another door on this side here. And we're gonna go through this one. And you'll see on the right hand side on the table is where the magazine is located. Okay. Back to the soul system. Last time here, we're going to the moon Titan by Saturn. So here, we're gonna go to the moon Titan and we're gonna go to the homestead. So teleport here. Once you get here, you'll see there's this building structure in front of you when you land here. You're just gonna go ahead and enter this building like this. So go through here. And then once you're in here, you're just going to run straight ahead. You'll see there's a staircase in front of you and there's like a door at the bottom. So just go down the stairs and, and go through the door. So just like this. Once you're through the door, just run straight to the back of the room and turn right and follow along this pathway. You'll see it turns left here. And then you're going to go through the mine, press the switch on the wall to open up the door and then follow this into the actual mine. And you'll see on the right hand side by the light over here, you'll pick up your skill magazine right there. Nice. Okay, so the next one we're gonna be going to is Narian. Narian over here, this system. So go ahead here. We'll be going to this planet on the far left here at Vectera. So over here, 
go to this location and you're going to rotate this and you're going to look for the Argos extraction mining place where we actually started the game, I think. And you're going to go look at the structure on the right hand side as you enter here and you're going to go press this button to go through this hab over here. So go in here into this building. You will have to press a button inside to open that door as well. And you're going to head to the right through the right again. And then you'll see there's this door over here. You're going to go through this door. And in not this room, the room next to it, right over here on the like coffee side, bedside table, you'll find the skill magazine. All right, so now we're gonna go to the leftmost system over here called Tau CT. So Tau CT over here, and we're gonna go to this planet over here, this one. And you'll see we're gonna be going to this specific spot over here. I do recall there was a quest here. I think it was earlyish in the game. Right now this area looks bugs because I don't remember there being floating rocks everywhere, but essentially you're heading to this first building. You can't miss it. This is like only one really big building here, I guess. So you're going to go into this building, this like main structure through this door here, and then you're going to go through the second door again. And on the right hand side on the table, you'll see right over here on this table here is where you can find the skill magazine that you need. All right, cool. Next system we're going back to, or going to, is the wolf system, is over here, just east of Seoul. We're going to go to the Den, which is on the planet on the left-hand side. The Den is a space station. Within 500 meters, you can dock it. When you get there and you board it, you will go to the far right side of the Den over here, through the rooms this way. Just keep following with me. We're going to keep going right all the way into the final room, and on this, like, shelf, you'll find the skill magazine right there. Okay, so now we're going to progress to Aquila City, because there's a ton there. We're going to go to the Cheyenne system, chain system bro i don't know how to say this word i really don't and so you're gonna go to aquila which is on this planet right over here so this one let's go here we're gonna go to aquila city so make sure you land at this spot and we're gonna we're gonna be here for a while so run through here i'm going to use the entrance here as a start point for all the others so get used to this area specifically where i'm standing right now and for the first one we're gonna go into the main building directly in front of us so super simple just go through the the doors in front like of this, you know, just the, the rock, I guess. And then just follow along with me over here. Go up the stairs like this, up the stairs again, and then go to the back of the room and go up the stairs and immediately turn right. So up the stairs here, turn right, and we're gonna follow along with me here to the back of this section over here. Don't go through that door, you're gonna turn right and right again and up the stairs. And then as soon as you get here, it's a right, uh, I think it's this one, yeah, through the stairs. And right at the top of these stairs here, you'll find a horn as well as the skill magazine there. So starting from the main entrance of Aquila City, just follow along with me here. I'm going to play this a little bit slower so that you can get the right turns here. We're going to be looking for Roland's arms over here, and we're going to go down this pathway up the stairs in front of me here. And you're essentially just going to head straight along this pathway until the first major building that's like blocks the pathway in front of you. So it's going to be Sinclair's books. Right down the stairs over here, this first store, you'll see as you enter the store and you immediately look to your right, on one of these tables, you'll find the skill book there. Starting from the entrance of Aquila City again, we're going to follow along here, make your way near the door again, and this time we're going to go up the stairs to the right. So you're just going to basically take all these stairs in succession. So it's going to be this one, it's going to be another set of stairs here. We're going to take that set of stairs in front of us here too, and there's going to be some more stairs and another pair of stairs, and the first door on the right that you can take here off to the stairs will be the co-estate. I do believe you have to progress the story a little bit to unlock this, but once you go in here, turn left, take the first door on the left, go into this room, and on the bedside table closest to the wall over here, you'll find a skill magazine. Okay, starting from the entrance of Aquila City again, this time you're going to head all the way back to the door in front of you here, but this time you're going to go up the stairs to the left of the rock building. So go up these stairs over here, up the stairs again, and then up these flights of stairs right over here. And the first building on your left, actually the one on your left right now, has a door over here on this side. And we're going to be going into the Free Star Collective House or building over here. And in the second room on the coffee table, right in front of you, you'll find the skill magazine. All right, the final one in Aquila City. It is dark, so I apologize for that. We're actually going to take this left over here from the entrance. And we're basically going to go in the middle of the city, but on the left outskirts kind of side. So what I'm going to do to make this easier here, I'm actually going to head straight to the wall and we're going to walk along the path of the wall on the left side of the city when you're entering from the entrance. So just follow along with me here. I'm on the wall just to give you a good indication of where we are. It's a nice easy spot to, to look for the house that we're looking for. The house is very specific looking. It's kind of like like broken down and it's kind of like just the bare foundations of it you'll see it in a second here we're going to go to this this final like watch post tower that i'm in right now 
And then from here, we can actually go down the stairs here. You'll see the building we're looking for is that one right in front of us there. The one that kind of doesn't have a roof and like walls and stuff. It's kind of like weird. This is the one. Go inside here and in the back, in a crate at the back, you'll find the skill magazine over there. Okay, so the next system we're going to is the Narion system right over here. So go to the Narion system. We're actually going to be going to this planet over here on the far right to the clinic. The clinic is a floating thing around the planet. You will have to dock once you get in here and you walk in. First thing on your left in the reception is where you can find a book on the table. The next one is actually going to be Velo, which is alongside the Narion system. But this time it's going to be on the left middle over here. So we're going to go to this planet right over here and go ahead and look for the Hope Town place location and go ahead and land there. Once you land there, you're going to run in here through the entrance and the first building on your right, the one that says Rangers on it, you're going to go in here and you're going to look on the chairs on the right hand side and you'll see the magazine is there. The next system we need to go to is down to the far right. This is going to be on Neon. So we're going to go to Volley. So Volley over here, bottom planet over here on the bottom right, and then you just go to Neon Core. So Neon Core, this is at the bottom of the elevator once you get out the elevator. So here's the elevator in Neon City. You're going to go this direction. So follow this direction outside the elevator where you spawn in and you're going to be looking for the Free Star Rangers building. You're going to go in here. You're going to go through this door right in front of you. And then from here, you're just going to follow along. We're going to go to the right. We're going to open up the big yellow door. So go through here, up the stairs on the left, follow along with the pathway just like this. Right in front of you, next to the bed, on the bedside table is the skill magazine. Back to the elevator on Neon. Well, this time we're going to go this direction. So main elevator on Neon Core. Heading this direction, we're going to go to the Astral Lounge. If you've done the Neon Story, which you will actually have to have done the Neon Story, at least um, Stroud's story, where you actually access the VIP area of Astral Lounge, because without that part of the story, you will not be able to go where we're going right now. So heads up. So make your way to the Astral Lounge, go in here. As you enter the Astral Lounge area, you're going to turn left and you're going to go to the VIP elevator. This is the one that you need to unlock through the story. Go ahead. Up the elevator, turn right, and you'll go into the first room on your right, and you'll see on a table right over here is where the final, the 20th one is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. No incidents on Mars at all. And thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed it.